Hi guys, how are you doing? This is day 307. I'm Gordy Camping. This is my daily update. Um, I hope you're well. I've got a really bad migraine right now. I say migraine, I'm probably over exaggerating. It's probably only a headache. Um, but yeah, I've been, oh, I've been quite busy today actually. More busy than I want to be for Saturday, to be fair. Um, what have I done? I got up late. Steve and I went shopping. I had a couple of hours walking around shops. Um, now, I don't mind shopping, right? Shopping's alright for me. But I need to be in the mood. And I'm not saying I wasn't in the mood to do it today, but I couldn't really be bothered by the time I'd been to, like, the third shop. Oh, shit. Um, my dinner's cooking, and I've just heard it burn. It's on fire! It's on fire! It's on fire! Oh! Um, how do I work this cooker? Uh, I don't know what I'm doing. There we go, that's better. Right, fix that. Um, so yes, uh, after like the first few shops, I just said, oh, what? Um, and I didn't actually get to buy anything. We did go and um, get some flowers and stuff for the garden. So when I get back from filming on set tomorrow, the garden should look lovely, but it's up to Steve to do it, because I won't be able to do it. So Steve, if you're... Oh, no, that he does. Steve, if you watch this, get those flowers planted, you G. <gasps> Um, yes, so Steve's got to do the garden tomorrow whilst I'm filming. Um, so, yeah, we've got two new characters on the set tomorrow. Um, well, filming two new characters um, on set tomorrow, which should be quite good. Um, I'm quite excited about it, and I'm going to post loads of pictures up on the Facebook page. So if you haven't been on the Facebook page, get over there now and like it. Just search for GC Productions, um, and you will find us. There's a little black man with a GC in his in his middle as a logo. Um, you should find it easy enough. Um, or you could follow us on Twitter, at Gordy Camp, which is me, or at GC Productions UK. Um, and you can follow us on Twitter as well to um, hopefully get daily updates um, during the day of pictures and status or whatever of what we're actually doing. Um, but yeah, it should be good. I'm quite excited. Good things happened. Good things have happened. I've got work for next week, which is cool. Um, that actually happened yesterday, not today. That's how busy today's been. I've lost I've lost track. Um, when did I do my daily update yesterday? Had I been to see the show? I don't know if I had. Um, no, I went to see three new short plays yesterday night, last night. Um, and I wrote a, a little review on them, so if you want to go and see them, they're on my website, theactorsays.blogspot.com. Um, so yeah, it was really, they were funny, like, I'm serious, funny, man. Excuse me. Um, th yeah, the first one was about a traffic warden, which was hilarious. Uh, and the second one was set in a nursing home. Now, the nursing home one, it was so realistic, like... In a funny way, I'm not saying I'm not saying nursing homes are like hilarious because it's a shame that there's old people going senile and stuff. Um, but generally, just watching how things happened and panned out, I was just in bits really. Um, and then the last one was just great. It was about just a man and a woman in their conservatory. Um, but the writing was the writing was amazing. I've got to say that, um, and I did say it in my blog as well, my review. Um, but yeah, it's it's bizarre because when you go and see new work, it's that noise. I keep hearing all these noises. Um, when I go and see new work, I never have any expectations. Even when I read the program, I don't read the program and then go, "Oh, this sounds like it's going to be like." Da, 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 because then you just you get you might get spoiled. Does that make sense? Or disappointed in some way. Um, whereas by not having any expectations, because it's a brand new piece. Um, it's so much better just to say, I'll take it for what it is, and if I enjoy it, I enjoy it. If I don't, then too bad, I don't. Ollie keeps farting. It stinks. You can't smell it, but it's disgusting. If you, How can I describe the smell right now? It smells like three eggs have been sat in the fridge for a week, but they've been cracked. That's how it smells. Um, or... Three eggs have been in the fridge uncracked for a week, um, but then covered in soy sauce, Worcestershire sauce, bad case of pepper, and then the eggs get boiled and left for a week. Let's say um, that's how Ollie's ass smells right now. Um, he stinks, man. I've got the smelliest dog in the world. Have you ever smelled a really bad dog? Or do you know someone who's got a smelly dog? And what do they smell like? Like, how smelly? 
because I'm sure I've got the smelliest dog in the whole whole world. There cannot be a smellier dog than this. I'll say that, right? Um, I, I've posted a couple of reviews on my blog as well, actually, guys. I've been watching some films. I watched Thor, I watched Little Red Riding Hood, um, Insidious. Uh, I've mentioned some of these on my daily updates before, but yeah, don't, if you haven't seen these yet, go and check them out. Um, uh, but if you go to the blog, there's a list on the side of what films I've reviewed and um, before you actually want to go and see them. Um, but yes, I hope you're well, guys. What have you guys been up to this weekend? Sorry, I keep looking down at the dog because of the smell. It's awful. Um, yeah, I hope you have a nice weekend. I hope you're doing something really productive and fun. Um, let me know what you're up to. Give me some comments in the down below. <laughs> or drop me a message and just say hey. And I will say just hey back. Yay! Um, but anyway, guys, I hope you're well. I love you lots, and I will catch up with you guys later. Oh, before I go, this morning, there was a rat in the garden. And it wasn't just any rat, it was a dead rat. Now, when I say dead, it wasn't just dead. It was the skin of the rat. So whatever caught this rat, I'm assuming it was a cat, it cut it open, it ate all its insides, and it left the skin on our garden step. Disgusting. Yeah, I hate rats generally. So when you find a dead one, but I was the one that had to clean it up. Steve couldn't even pick it up. He went outside to get it, and he said, "No, I can't do this. I can't do this." So I had to go out and pick it up and put it in the bin. <sighs> anyway, guys, what, what was I saying? Yeah, goodbye. Hope you're having a nice day. Have a nice afternoon. Depending where you are in the world, love you lots, guys. Do stay in touch and have a nice weekend. Bye. <laughs>